Well, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kids. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> All right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I'm still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. Hey, this should hold. Oh, good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? What? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Oh, hey, shit! Yeah. Get out! Okay, we're good. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did, a little. But this place is so big, without knowing where to look, it's like shooting in the dark. Or like blowing shit up in the dark. <coughs> so you think we'll just find a tombstone that says, Here lies Henry Avery, loving son and notorious pirate. Yeah, I doubt it. I don't think he'd go through all that trouble to hide his tracks just to put his name on a rock. <coughs> what is this place? The monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. Yeah, location, location, location. More shoreline equipment. Uh, at least no shoreliners. Now, what do you bet? Yep. Dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? huh. Hey, got the door open. That was... Very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Well, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. It's too high for a boost, though. Well, let's find something to climb on. Yeah.
about this? Hey, we can use this to climb out of that building. Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. There. Come on, let's go. Got it. Oh, careful. I can hook that. There. You think you can do that? What are you talking about? I taught you that move. All right, let's see it then. There. You see? That was clumsy. <laughs> Sam, there's a ladder just out of reach. All right, hold up. I'll come over. Give me a boost. Come here. I'll pull you up. Thanks. All right, there it is. A mug storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Ah, uh, don't jinx it. Here we go. <laughs> Burns a little. Huh. Those are fun. <laughs> This all day. Shh, you go where the money leads you. <laughs> That's cold. It gets colder. I'm gonna take a leak while you educate our young recruit. So what happened next? Did he put down the revolt? With our help, he put it in play. And once money ran out, nice one. Well, there's no reason for us to stick around anymore. And the general didn't even last. You get the left one. I got right. <laughs> 
Gotta have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. Kind of hairy. Someone was bound to hear all that. Come on, let's get a move on. Nathan, it's this way. Right beyond those walls. Whoa, we're not gonna jump this ravine. Gonna need to find another way around. Down we go. Where does that bitch also get off? Easy, bro. On the end of the Bad view. Jumping. Have you ever been bungee jumping? No, but I'm <clears throat> sure this is better. So, <clears throat> this is what you've been up to all these years? <clears throat> jumping around ruins? Yeah, that and getting shot at. Blown up, punched, kicked. 
All right, all right, I get it. Knifed, drugged. That's that. Uh, not quite. We're gonna climb high across the ravine. I hope we're done sliding for a while. My ass is full of gravel. You ready for this? <laughs> Stuck the landing. There was nothing. Dude. I could get used to this. Hey. Give me a hand. Come on. All right, I got it. Go. Okay, come on. And we're here. <laughs> yes, we are. Jesus. Wait, look at this place. Welcome to the St. Dismas Dormitory, alleged final resting place of one Henry Avery. <laughs> Let's find that grave. Hey, Nathan, check it out. This one's got a pair of cutlasses. Looks like the scroll from the cross. The dates aren't right. Well, one down and... A hell of a lot to go. Okay. Cross cutlasses, skull and crossbones, and the date 1659 to 1699. We find a tombstone with all three, and we're in business. Well, let's desecrate some graves. Let's. Nope, no cross swords. Not our guy. No skull and crossbones. Nice Celtic cross. Not the grave we want, though. Yeah, well, swords are a match. So is the year. Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? Uh, Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. <laughs> Something odd about this skull, though. It's like it doesn't belong to the stone. Well, I mean, what's odd about it is that's not Avery's sigil. Huh. Yeah, I mean, the skull should be facing... Sideways. sideways. <laughs> what is that? Oh my God. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh, I've been ready for a long time. <laughs> Let's see what we got. A crypt? A crypt? 
Hidden behind a secret door? I assume the secret door was added afterwards. <laughs> to hide his loot? Well, fingers crossed. Ho oh, ho. Gang's all here. Is this a door? Looks like a door. I don't see a way to open it, though. What are these star symbols? Jesus? Dismiss on the left. Penitent thief? Guest is on the right. Jerk thief. <laughs> Avery sure had a thing for St. Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Only plundered and murdered the non-British heathens. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. <laughs> Some kind of lamp. Hey, Smokey. Need your lighter over here. <laughs> you know, that hurts my feelings. Not as much as it hurts your lungs. <laughs> Thank you, Father Duffy. Isn't that something? Oh. <laughs> the light's coming from the other side of the wall. Uh, let's see here. Ah, uh, I can aim the lights. <laughs> I am loving this. Hey, here we go. Oh, connect the dots. There we go. Nathan, that's it, you got it. Okay, let's give this a shot. <sighs> Sesame. Wrong treasure. Shush. <laughs> well, nice view. No treasure, though. No, but... Look, you see those crosses? Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, is that a cave? Right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. Uh, there's one problem, though. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. And back towards Rafe. Shit. Well, let's not keep him waiting.
Okay, I think we're clear. Well, that could have gone better. Yeah, well, we're still breathing. That's good enough. Let's just get that gate open. Are you holding up? <laughs> Great. I was kind of hoping to find the treasure back there, but you know, it's never that easy, right? It's been my experience. Also, it was a cool yeah, it was cool. Spectacular. Right under that high cross. That's where Avery wants us. Well, what Avery wants, Avery gets. Kid, what's your status? Hey, Sully. We're on the trail, but uh, treasure's closer to the cathedral than we originally thought. Oh, boy. So what do you need me to do? Uh, just keep those engines warm. We'll be back before too long. You got it. Keep me posted. Will do. There's no getting away from these guys. Yeah, and there'll only be more as we get closer to the cathedral. Okay, coming. Here we go. Come on, I'll boost you up there. All right. <laughs> Hell, I'm too high to reach you. Yeah, hang on a sec. Hanging. Let me see what's by that wooden structure over there. I got something. Yep, we go. Christ, this thing's heavy. What exactly are you doing? Giving you a way up. That'll support even your weight. Ah, thank you. I think the monks built this. No way. It's some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? To lift something. I can't believe I missed this. Yeah. Clearly we were meant to find it together. <laughs> oh, so romantic.
<laughs> hey, we can climb this! On my way! <laughs> Save your strength, huh? Not done yet. Just lead the way. <laughs> Hope this holds. from here. Probably at home. Drinking hot cocoa? What are you, five? Oh, tell me you wouldn't go for some hot cocoa right now. Well, I mean, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> hey, check it out. Just about there. There's no path along the cliff. All right, let's cut back inland. This sounds good. Here we go. I hope we're done with these idiots. Yeah. <laughs> 
Hey, careful. Might be unstable after the blast. Who does excavation with dynamite? Mercenaries. I think Rafe would know better, though. Hey, Sam, help me with this. Uh, yeah, well, what if it's the only thing holding the tunnel up? Then I'll apologize. <laughs> <laughs> See? No problem. Yeah, for once. Those things look sturdy to you? Sturdy enough. Hey, be extra careful on these. Oh, crap! Huh. Remember, extra careful. Thanks. Okay. Huh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Kid, don't pick it up. How's it looking? We're about to head into the cave. The cave? Yeah, might lose contact for a bit. Don't get too worried. All right. Call you soon. <laughs> we made it. It's quite the detour. Well, let's go see what Avery left for us. Yes, please. Those shoreline assholes were right next to this cave. Yeah, but I think we're the first ones in here. Come on. Through here. But I didn't eat a big breakfast. <clears throat> Creepy St. Dismas statues? Check. Carved stairs? Check. Nathan, I think it's safe to say we're in a pirate cave. Come here. Check this out. A little slimy. There's a handle in here or something. Well, give it a give it a pull. What? Could be a trap. You're already in there. What's the what's the worst that could happen? Uh I lose my hand? So we'll get you a nice hook. Give it a pull. Nice hook. All right, here we go. Really? Hello, hello. It's pretty interesting decor. Those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. To those who prove false, behold your grim fate. Yeah, well, I guess Avery was a better pirate than a poet. This, this isn't Avery's. What do you mean? Look, it's the Rhode Island pirate. Thomas too. Yeah, but it can't be him. I mean, this is clearly his sigil, but two died attacking the same treasure fleet as Avery. Yeah, well, at least that's what the stories tell us. If this really is Two's mark, then that means he's involved in all of this... how? That's a damn good question. So who do you think these guys are? Know, those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas, too, are just trying to scare us. Good thing we're jaded treasure hunters. <laughs> Good thing. That bridge looks about as safe as the others. Oh. Oh. 
It's okay, it's holding. Come on. These bridges are clearly not built to cope. Sure they are. The pirate code. <laughs> not bad. We're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. Found another. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the hand out. Whoa. Jesus. It's a pretty elaborate test. Trial? Yeah. When this guy clearly failed. Let's do better. something on the bottom there it's a bucket huh okay now what <clears throat> yeah Bucket filled. All right, pass it up to me. <laughs> Put it back in that big wheel thingy. Let's see what these wheels do. Okay, I think I see what's going on here. Is something with the three crosses? Yeah. I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus, our good thief Dismas, and the jerk thief Gestus. Well, I'm gonna figure the white cross is Dismas, so the black one is Gestus. That's it? Well, you could try pulling the switch. I could. There we go. Hey, Sam, was Dismas to the left of Jesus? Well, are you looking at them from the front or the back? In the front. Then, yeah, he was on the left. Okay, that's what I've got. Nathan, Nathan. You sure you got this? That I, I was.
<sighs> oh, crap! Huh. The crosses are all definitely in the right place. Well, then I'm guessing the bucket is not. There's the light at the top up there. Check it out. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. There's a channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay, so bucket on top is good. Keep it there. Okay, that's gotta be it. Now let's find out. Let's? So you're gonna pull the switch? today so if that was a test you suppose it was testing exactly filling a bucket I had to know about st. Dismas whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with it's not that hard of a test maybe it's not the only one Okay, I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Okay, I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. Sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. Ceiling here. Watch it. Ow! Watch my ah! Can it? I see some light through here. Noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. 
My men have been a bit liberal with yeah, the dialogue. like a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. <laughs> progress? I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No! I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I'll listen to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out? <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point is, I'm done trying to do things the clean way. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well... Maybe it's time to move on, huh? It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. Let's get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. I'm gonna start making out. <laughs> hey, wait. You think she was right, though? But what? About Rafe, want to draw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand, who cares? Doesn't matter. What <laughs> annexed area you suppose they were talking about? There's got to be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. A little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, darn. Wait, do you, do you have a trampoline? <laughs> I wish. Hang on. Oh, look at you. One crate coming up. Thank you, good sir. Now well, we're 
we're definitely getting closer to the cathedral. Gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. <laughs> Me too. Bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Here goes nothing. <clears throat> Good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? I'm working on it. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Needs bridges. Oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? <laughs> Over here. Look at that. If this place wasn't completely falling apart, we'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap! This must have been another test, but. All just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is how the hell do we get to the other side? <coughs> that really safe looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. <coughs> Worth the shot. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> Appreciate everything that goes into making one of these dead traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Who's being glib? This is a marvel of human engineering. Any luck? Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. Heavier than I am. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Hey, nice air time. Uh, well, if treasure hunting doesn't work out, we can always join the circus. Uh, not if they have clowns. Well, still not over that, huh? No one is. Thanks. There's another test down. Yeah, at this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Okay, getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site? Or build elaborate tests? Ugh. I'll never get used to this.
Another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Agreed. Yeah. Or lack thereof. Okay, so... It's, it's gotta be the coins. Yes. Are we sure about this? Oh, pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Right, just, just one now. Great, I got it. Please don't be a trap. Recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look, star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with this. What are you talking about? Avery, he's screwing with this. This was supposed to be it, so where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, King's Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have known you from last time. Uh, throwing me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot him yet. <laughs> Not want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. You two. I'm gonna leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross that. You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it! the plan. I'm working on it.
Story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, I think it's hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. The weather is lovely this time of year. I can't see shit. Just keep heading down until we hit the water.
was a close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, Nate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. Do you think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? I, just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the gun's way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? people who survived the caves, the recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news, there's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket, Ben? Uh, you know, you don't have to do that. It's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. The map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. We see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. 
Oh, Victor. Still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo. Uh, yeah, sure, mm. but I Not prefer talking here. to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. <clears throat> well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest for by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Oh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Hey, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going. <laughs> ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. We're getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. Don't spin out now. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road, it might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch? All right, hang on tight. Oh, oh shit. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. That was a valiant effort. That mud's too slippery. Time to come up with a plan B here. Check out that tower. I'll come with. Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape or something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. There. That ought to do it. Look, that's 
Christopher Condon's sigil is uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That'll make sense. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, yeah. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taken forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. Oh, shit, stop, stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Okay, I think that's it. God damn it, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Yeah. <laughs> 
Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. More of a money-up-front kind of mercenary. The rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Just thinking the same damn thing. If they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge. How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> Hey, Nathan, come check this out. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonnie. Mm hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. I thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Hey, 
Hey, be careful, kid. Hey, guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! I should deliver it! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kid, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. Dude, just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. that bridge down. There we go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Yeah, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. <laughs> Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. <laughs> I'm exactly expecting <laughs> to be carded. <laughs> All set. Here we go. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, kid! 
I got you. Come on, come on. You okay? I've been better. Get us out of this, kid. All right, hang on. Help Mary pull the drapes over the sweeping place of the above women and places the food they will. Easy, kid. Easy. Ah. Well, that was fun, right? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. The whole thing under control. This is where we get off, kid. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's see what we got here. something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. <sighs> Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. <clears throat> heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! He's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Hey guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. 
And that's, uh... Um, that's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrow, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <coughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, our treasure's got to be in one of them, right? <laughs> yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Hope so. You okay? Yeah. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Uh, but still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm going to take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. If you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. <laughs> All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. <laughs> but we've seen crazy before. That we have. Excuse me. Ah, 
Sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. Sully. Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. All the way down. You okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. <laughs> yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? Okay, let's see what we got. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. This is a very tall clock tower. Yes. Yes, it is. like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. I'll be right back. Okay, 
watch your fingers, Nate? Should I be nervous? No, good. Trust me.
Taurus. <laughs> Worst. view. Hands are lined up. I can get across. No, 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 no. Jesus. I made it! This is gonna be loud! Sully, heads up! Sorry! The handle broke! I'm gonna have to ring it myself. Ah, here we go. Go, go, go. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? Well, that's one way to do it. You all hey. right? Hey, look. The coin. You want it? Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's see what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally. You okay? Just search my towel. I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. <laughs> Sully. Way ahead of you. <laughs> Those are boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in... Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah. They got those star patterns on them. They turn. But which way are they supposed to go? Just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condent. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Wow, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. Hmm. Hmm. Look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Content went by Billy. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? I bet these line up, too. Hmm. That's, um, they are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. 
No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Want, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. But Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Books, globe. This Want guy looks like a scholar. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. <sighs> Is it straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. Nah. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather nah, be nah. anywhere else. There.
Okay. So who do we have here? Uh... You know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. Don't. I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful. That's all. Aha. Uh -huh. Of course. Shit. What happened here? A uh, torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. That's one. Oh, Sam texted me back. Now, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Gloating is unseemly. Yeah, I know. Let's just look at the paintings. Huh. No name. This guy's get-up looks Moorish. Found the stars, but who are you? Huh. Yazid al-Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. Nah. -uh. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. Nada. Nah. -uh. That's three. Edward England. Stout little fellow. All right, I got the names of two of them. We should still be able to figure this out. Not sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just saying. Okay, that's one. And two. Last one. All right, let's see what he makes of them. You know, that kind of looks... Huh. What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Yeah, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh, 
All right. These could be trade winds. Yeah. And these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, Boyle. What? Pro Deus quod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, it's so obvious. Nate. Why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? <laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. It's been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner, well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow. Oh, Rafe Adler, taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. I'm willing to forgive and forget. For old time's sake. As tempting as that sounds, Rafe. I gotta say, I'm not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quote licentia, forgotten liberty. These are nice pictures, Nate. Good composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I really gotta take this call, so... Well, Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? I'll see you soon, buddy. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now and destroy your phone. What's going on? Rafe knows where we are. All right, we gotta find some place to hide. Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey. Buy a new one. <laughs>